On October 23, 1918, the Spanish flu arrived in foremost. The community quickly responded by enacting various health protocols. This included the immediate closing of the school and suspending organized meetings and church services. Residents of the community waited for health advisories that were issued daily to help people know what they needed to do in order to care for the sick. These notices were posted in public places and in newspapers in the area. No one was safe from the flu, and it hit everyone from the young to the old. Many people relapsed with the flu thinking they had beat it. Tom Seaman was the special constable for the epidemic. He and his volunteers worked hard to get the people to health clinics where they could get the care they needed. Tom Seaman was the special constable for the epidemic. He and his volunteers worked hard to get the people to the health clinics where they could get the care they needed. The bylaws were quickly passed in the community to outlaw all meetings. Sadly, five people died by November 13th. Several more people would die in the coming days. In March 1919, the flu came back but was less severe, but before long it had once again passed into history.